Each Ooh. of you represents some of the most powerful criminal organizations in the galaxy. Okay. Pikes, Crimson Dawn, Huts. It's a golden Let's give it. I, I, hold on. I feel like the Empire control. Okay. From from that aspect, I feel like when he said that the Empire controls Holds every corner of the galaxy. So does that mean we can like? like choose which what uh, which faction to work with like we can go back and forth with like between um that's and all the all the all the factions he just mentioned right now like right here Each hold on represents some of the most powerful criminal organizations in the galaxy pikes okay Dawn, okay huts so does that mean we can side with which one we want to be? Because we're a smuggler, we can like play with um, both sides. We could we can like side with the Empire. At the same time, we could side with the Republic. It's a golden age for the underworld. The Empire controls every corner of the galaxy. Okay. But they're distracted by a rebellion that won't quit. Nice. It's an opportunity to make millions. Kay Vess, the underworld's favorite new scoundrel. Ah. I'm not gonna lie, I actually am excited for this game. Even though Ubisoft made it, I am actually excited for this game. Because I, I've been playing Assassin's Creed. I think Assassin's Creed 1 was one of my first games that I actually enjoyed from their com from that company and uh, after Assassin's Creed 1 just kept going up and up to this day I still am actually mad not mad so basically I let my friend borrow Assassin's Creed 1 and he never returned it to this day I don't know he probably forgot about it but I've just just like I had to buy it. I was. It was around the time the other one was coming out, and he wanted to try the first one. Uh, so I'm like, Yo, you here? You could uh, let you borrow it. And ever since that day, I never let anyone borrow uh, uh, a game of mine, even if they were my friends. I'm like, nope. I learned my lesson that day. We need it last. What do you want? Okay. Let's see. Where are are. I'm assuming we're on his ship right here. Yeah, we are. But why was he looking for her? Zarek Besh. They're new, rich, and lethal. You crossed their boss, Sliro, and now he wants you gone. So, that's basically what a smuggler... I'm assuming that's basically what she was doing earlier. She was just doing her job and that's it and someone got mad and whatever it's probably gonna go on and run listen anyone will be mad if you're in her side like if you're doing the same thing that she was doing whoever you're stealing from they'll be mad so it was there's nothing new here rob his fortune buy but why this is the confusing part right here why buy your freedom is he playing is he trying to trick her this job, it's a death wish. She knows it's a death wish, and at the same time, she's going for it. Makes no sense. Hey, go with the flow. And looks like we have someone here. I think he's part of the story, or yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I'm in. I'm actually in. I am. I'm. I'm like this guy right now. This guy is excited for the adventure that's going to be happening in this game, and I am hoping it's an actually open world game. When I'm, I don't know. I'm just excited. And from the look, this is beautiful. I didn't play Avatar yet because I hate Avatar, but uh, I'm assuming. From all the like the, the the footage I watched with like the streams and 
the gameplay videos on YouTube that it's the environment is really good. So I hope they take that aspect from Avatar and just make this much bigger. I hope we can go to different planets. Like you see, see the planet behind this planet that we're on. I hope we could just fly off the, with our ship and just go over there. That's what I'm hoping for. Out here, you live and die by. Such a beautiful sight. Let me go back. Look at this. I'm I'm seriously hoping the game it looks like this, and it's not just a downgrade. You live and die by your reputation. You want to survive? Know the player. Hello. What do we have here? Out here, you live and die by your reputation. You want to survive? No. Okay, so we have a, we're at a cantina here, and this reminds me a little bit of was it Knights of the Old Republic, where you go into like a cantina and there was like battle, like a like a fist fight tournament or something. I don't remember. I don't recall. But this reminds me of that, and each lobby or each each uh booth had um someone managing that fighter that's this is what this looks like and i'm assuming these guys are here for the bets the players you're new to this world What's your problem? come back when you're not yep this looks jabba, like it right Look, and don't try anything. jabba we met jabba not a whole crew surrounding the okay we're skipping what I'm afraid of is if he just opens the, the trap door under her. Oh my goodness, that'll be bad. Sing that part. For about as long as I can remember, it's just been me and Nyx. Doing what we have to to survive. This job is my. Look at this, man. I'm telling you, if this is how it looks like in the game, I'm sold. One shot at freedom. Hey, does that mean we get some parkour in this game? But if we're gonna pull this off... Yeah, a little bit of Assassin's Creed in there, like a little sprinkle of Assassin's Creed. Come on, give us something. We need the right crew. And the right ship. Oops, there you go. Yes. So, this is our ship. Oh, I'm actually excited. You know, the, the only thing I'm nervous about is what platforms this is going to be released in because I do not know. I'm hoping it gets released on PC. In Windows, I mean. I hired Please. You because you were one of the best hunters in the Outer Rim. She's more connected than you let on, Slero. Best is mixed up in something bigger. Much bigger, like, what's going on here? Like, did she mess with the wrong person? Because uh, at the beginning, right, the guy said that he, I mean, yeah, that he was mad at her, right? And now... One of the best hunters in the album. She, she is saying that someone bigger is going after her. So there is another boss here. To rim. She's more connected than you let on. See what I mean? Slero. Best is mixed up in something bigger. What is she mixed up in? Don't tell me. You know what? You know, I, I just hope there's some connections to uh, the, the story. Uh, some way. I don't know how they're going to connect it to the story, but it'll be great to see some like cameos. The outer rim is a dangerous place. Everyone is fighting for their piece of the galaxy. Okay. But all I want is to live free. If you want to live free, why are you going after danger? Like that's I mean you could just go to an open planet that's peaceful and just be 
free and you know don't you're, you're not gonna get bothered but nope you're looking for the adventure that means you're looking for trouble so i'm gonna risk it all for what Outlaws pre-order available now. I would pre-order it, to be honest. I'm trying to see where what platforms this is being released on. And I don't see anything. Probably Google it after. You know what? I'll Google it right now. Hold on, I'm Googling it. PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X, and Series S, and Microsoft Windows. There you go. I am going to pre-order it. But we'll see. I might, I might actually go for it, this man. This game looks amazing. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I just wanted to um, skim through this, you know. So, so I'm assuming this is this round table. We'll probably meet some of these people before we meet this guy. So we'll probably have to fight um, a bunch of these people. Like, is it? so like this could be a boss. This guy could be a boss. These, I'm assuming these are all the bosses we're going to be encountering in the game. And they're just, just, they're just foreshadowing it. But yeah. Overall, this trailer looks good, man. I'm looking forward to it. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I uh, will see you guys next time. I'm going to... I was thinking of playing a game today. But I wanted to check out the trailer. So. And tomorrow... I'll probably uh, play something. I don't know. But I wanted to check out this trailer and I wanted to give my thoughts about it. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all have a wonderful day. I will see you guys next time. Take care. Bye.